Work experience for the pupils of Avonmouth Community School is a vital part of their careers and work related education and they start that when they join us in year 7. Pupils go when they're in year 10 and it's important because it's an opportunity for them to experience the world of work. It doesn't necessarily have to be in a career or a profession that they want to go into sort of when they get older but it is about them experiencing what it's like to get up in the morning travel somewhere, be at work all day, cope with the demands of that role, some that they will thoroughly enjoy, others that they won't and I think it gives them that insight into what things are going to be like for them when they leave us at the end of year 11 and go on to post 16 education, apprenticeships and that type of thing. Um, probably one of the most like bigger skills that I've learned is like team, team working like as you can see here they're all um, together like working together to pull apart the car I've also been uh, learning how to like sand down cars and prepare them for painting, as well as removing um, certain types of bolts and putting them back in place. Done really well, done really, really well. It's one of the better ones we've had. He's uh, shown a lot of enthusiasm in everything we've asked him to do. He's been on time every day. First of all, always be polite. Greet everyone with a smile, and just make sure you like make sure everyone is aware of you and always offer help. They're going to learn learn skills that they need to develop from within themselves and with other people so I kind of think of them as internal skills when we think about sort of them getting up on time to go to work, being able to learn about public transport and how to get to various places and developing the confidence to do that. I've been like typing up the letters to clients and searching whether the dates of it, whether it's been last checked. They shouldn't be nervous because it's not Bad at all. People who would want an office job or a law job would need good communication skills. Um, it's been a good, a useful week. Uh, I've learnt new things. Um, I've been doing um, a lot of different stuff, um, such as um, using a camera, learning different techniques. I've learnt that you get a lot of pressure in in work experience, and um, you. Um, also have to be a bit flexible at times. Well, sometimes, um, let's say for a year 10, coming into an environment like this, there's so much going on, it's very hard to keep up. But if they're diligent and enthusiastic and stick with the programme, uh, eventually, as with any job I suppose, it becomes a lot easier and more enjoyable. Because when people go to different companies, they're not meant to be a hindrance or to slow things down, they're meant to be an addition to the workforce so that the companies are pleased for them to be there. I expected, I thought it would be easier and there would be less jobs to do. And she has had to do some mundane tasks like sorting out the store cupboards and counting stock and things like that. They will learn what their strengths are, what are, not a weakness, but things that they need to develop for when they leave us in year 11. I'd say First, choose uh, uh, somewhere to work, really, uh, something which is related uh, to what you would like to do in the future, as you'd enjoy it. And I'd say uh, just be confident, always work hard, and be willing to do more than what was expected of you. If you want to go somewhere in particular, it's really important that you get a self-placement and that you start looking for those round about Christmas time if you want it to be very specific. Those that are not sort of able to do that for whatever reason will be given a school placement. They will be asked what areas of work that they would be interested in but they need to be prepared about that they, it could be anywhere. In January of each year pupils will receive, will receive a launch assembly where someone will talk to them about what work experience is. Within that assembly there will be lots of information given and they need to listen carefully. I think the main benefit of work experience is that pupils get to experience working in a completely different environment to a school environment. Working with people who are older than they are, uh, with different life experiences, so you've got social skills, you've got the problem skills of working in that different environment and hopefully you've got the career aspiration being built upon, working in an industry that they want to work in in future life. The advice that I would give is just choose what you're good at and what you like. So that's the way you're going to enjoy it most and learn more skills. Just make sure like you're, you know what you want to do, you know what, what you're doing and how you're going to approach it. I found him very interesting that he's interested in something to make something out of himself. I even offered him to train him during his summer holidays if he wants to come in. I was so impressed with him. 
they'll be given dates and different deadlines of when things need to be done. One of the first things they'll receive is a pack with a permission letter and then lots of other forms that they need to complete and they have to bring them back on time and they have to bring back every single form because for example if they don't bring back the information regarding what they're interested in the person allocating the work experience is just going to give them whatever is left so if they really want something to be specific they need to actually make sure that they do everything they, they want.